guys it's Smashy here and welcome back to another Raid Shadow Legends video and today we're having a little chat really um, as well as uh, a shard opening it's not very many shards so if that's what you're here for I'm so sorry but it's not very many um, essentially what I wanted to talk to you about is our new event um, I was going to do a video about this yesterday and as you guys should know by now i'm a very positive person i like speaking positively about life and about the game and my disappointment yesterday was that i didn't want to do this video so i released a different video for raid shadow legends instead it was one of my doom tower videos I believe that honesty is the best policy. I'm not affiliated with Plarium or anything like that, but I think that I have been thus far anyway, a, a good advocate for the game. But with regards to this event, so I logged in yesterday morning, I'd just woken up and I saw summon draft and guaranteed champion two simultaneous events for double the glory and i was so so excited so i clicked on it and i read and i'm sure you've read this already um but essentially for this weekend guaranteed champion event brilliant absolutely fantastic a hundred and 50 shards this champion Countess Lix by the way is fantastic I have met her in arena um, this morning actually and she she was great she was um, we did win that arena match but I can see that she would be a great asset to an arena team especially but 150 shards maximum in order to obtain her the thing that frustrated me the most i think is the fact that this has come off the back of a triple double time summoning event and as a lot of you have seen i have done a video where i opened literally all of my free to play ancient shards so my account at the minute i am sat on five and if i go to the shop i do have enough oh hello i do have enough in order to buy more so i'll do that but another thing that got to me was in the shop the amount of offers there are for ancient shards at the minute so Plarium are you are you really playing off the fact that you've just had everybody use their shards and now you're bringing out offers to replace those shards one two there was another one but I think it's ended now it just makes me feel that it's a bit of false advertising really it's a guaranteed championing yes but how much money would you have to put in to get those 150 shards and they've even given this this lovely uh, meter so that you can see exactly how many you've used in terms of the ta uh, the targeted boosts if you press the i button you can see here there are some worthy champions here uh Kandrafon is in particularly a good champion that i would love to have in my team um i would love to have roxam he's not the best champion in the world but i think he looks fantastic so yes it's exciting champions in which they are advertising here um, and i love how it looks like acid is dripping off countess Lix's wings um 
and I'm not going to spend time going through her abilities um, in detail um, because I'm sure that you've seen plenty of content about her already. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to collect those shards and open them for you and you know what I could get her but it doesn't take away from the fact of what I feel this game is trying to do. So uh, we have space for eight shards, we have gold for them, silver I should say. Here we go, number one. Can you imagine if I got her on the first one? Grinner. Here we go. Oh, got too many of you. Bombardier usually uses food. Channeler. Metal shaper. Tree filler. I've got two left, guys. Here it is. Here she is. Here she is. Ah, okay, look. But that's it, guys. Um, I am not going to be purchasing any shards. I just feel that... I feel really disappointed, as I've said. And... I don't want to put money on the game at this time despite these offers being right in front of me I've even uh, been spamming dungeons this morning trying to get a few more ancient shards for you and unfortunately I couldn't get any more so that's it um, that's how I will finish the weekend unfortunately um, but do think about it guys it's a lot of money um, it's only guaranteed on that 150th shard you could be you know burning money burning money until the very last one the game doesn't have to proc that shard opening until the very end um, so just be mindful about that um, one more thing before I go, I know that this was day to mine this event and maybe this maybe this has affected my disappointment but there were quite a few content creators who, uh, well one in particular who found out this information and then there's a few videos that came out from other creators who were equally as excited as I was thinking that for the birthday of the game that we were going to be given something and you know we're used to seeing gifts we're used to seeing uh, your mystery shards and your ancient shards um, and that daily pack that you get that I've already opened your daily login rewards but these are small little um, assets that you're you're given um, and you know you are given um, a champion at the end of each page but I just feel that I was expecting too much maybe maybe it's maybe it's my fault um, that I thought that we were going to get more um, than what we were given um, I am interested to hear what you think I have watched a few videos on this myself and I've seen some mixed opinions some people were very excited about this event I'm wondering if perhaps that was uh, from people with more disposable income perhaps that they had the extra cash in order to participate or you know just the idea of having a different kind of event um, in the game let me know what you think anyway uh, drop me a comment below and as I say I just like to apologize in a way that this isn't a more positive video um, as I say I do like to remain positive I believe in you know without wanting to sound cheesy 
I'm here to entertain you and help you and I don't like making these videos so thank you for your patience um, if you would be so kind to drop a like on the video um, if you would like to and um, if you'd like to see some more content from me in the future hit that subscribe button and you'll be notified of when there is a new video from me so thank you very much and have a lovely day goodbye